Hey guys, I hope you're all doing very well today. So, I am going to show you in this video how I groom and trim my eyebrows. As you can see, they're looking pretty raggedy right now. I left them to grow just for this video. I also thought I'd show you how to use a corrective palette. Here we go. First things first, I use a couple of tools. I use a... I'm not sure what this is called, but I will call it a multi-tool. This one's pretty cool because it's got a little blade on the insides, a little bristle side, and then a little plastic comb side. I also use a basic old tweezer. I'm sure all you ladies out there have one of these at home. And then a little scissor. First thing I do is comb up my eyebrows a little bit. I do use a little bit of um, eyebrow wax just to get them to sort of stand up straight. So I usually just take the tweezer and now that they're all, you know, out of the way from the bottom, I just start to tweeze that area. Just follow your natural line. Less is definitely more in this case. Alright, so once you have plucked around the area, and I usually go ahead and I take the um, comb side again with a little bit of wax. <laughs> Trim! So what you do is you just hold up the hairs and you just slightly trim them. Obviously don't go too overboard with this, but just so that you get the little sections where the hair starts to curl, cut off. That's essentially what you're trying to do over here. It just helps to make it look way smoother. It's just a quick fix for when your eyebrows are looking a little crazy, all right? Here I have my uh, corrective color palette made and ready to go. The lilac color, you're just going to use this on sections that are a little bit dull and need a little bit more vibrance. For the green color, you're going to um, use this to hide any sort of redness on your face or anything like that. And then for the yellow color, you just use that to cancel out any blue or purplish tones in your skin, usually underneath your eyes and things like that. And then for the peach color, it's just another way of taking away any sort of dark circles or things like that around your eye area. Or anywhere else on your face for that matter. Now I'll let you know what each one does. So you just have to do it based on your face, not necessarily exactly what I'm doing. Okay. Over here I've got a little bit of redness. I can see that already. In the corner of my eyes I can see I have some purple sort of coloring over there. Let's see what we can do over here. And then we move on to just blending this mess in. <laughs> and then of course we just add foundation. 